Welcome to the Oaks. Yeah, we are uh, doing some potatoes today. Um, Tony said he got a little bit of a, you know, gurgle, gurgle, and next thing I know, he was, you know, stiff legged it and just running real hard towards the house. So I think he might have ate something wrong. Um, we haven't gotten very much done, if you can't tell. But, um, we do have some new equipment, thanks to the used market, and, well, ended up having to buy this new. What, this potato harvester? It, it's weird, it lays down, Tony will explain it, he knows it a little bit better than I do. But no, we got a new 8R, 410, you know, something nice, you know. I mean, it's nice because it's new. Okay, that, that's what we'll say. It's nice because it's new. Um, yeah, it's not nice because it's a John Deere. But regardless, we also got a new Volvo. Well, new to us. See, looks like he's even wearing a little hat. But, and we also got the uh, Trinity Live Bottom trailer. Because uh, apparently it, it, it holds a lot more than our little trailer over there there if you can kind of see it yeah you can kind of see it but uh yeah it's, apparently this is made for potatoes i guess i don't know i'm not a potato well now i'm a potato farmer but i wasn't a potato farmer until yesterday so my knowledge is very very limited but if you guys like today's video make sure you guys hit that thumbs up if you're new around here consider subscribing and uh stick around for the uh well, how, how do you want to call it? Um, pain? Yeah. Yeah, that, that's what we're going to... Yeah, yeah, that's definitely what we're going to call it. Pain. Um, I'm going to wait for uh, Tony to get back from his uh, tummy issues. I'm coming. You okay? Uh, I'm, I'm okay. Yeah, sure. I, I thought you'd be used to eating spicy things. You never get used to it. Oh, fair enough. So what all exactly are we doing? Potatoes. I, I, Lovely taters. I, I see that. Um. All right, I talked to a guy, right? This is how they he says is the best way to do it. We got these two Sputniks. They put the potatoes on the ground. Now we got to come back and pick them up. Or I should say, you probably have to come pick them back up. But that's another conversation. Oh, great. So we're going to run these two side by side, dumping these potatoes on the ground. We're going to do a lap around, give ourselves some room. And then we got this beautiful truck over here. When we pick them up, we'll put them in there. Okay. Beautiful oh. truck. It is a beautiful truck. It even has a nice little, well, it looks like it has a hat. A hat. It's very fancy because it's British. Yep. So, um... I guess I'll let you get started and then I'll follow behind. That's the plan. All right, let's go. Oh, it's gonna be fun. It's good. <laughs> uh, all right. I'm just glad you get to run in the old tractor. Hey, this is a, it's a classic. Oh, okay. You made a little bit too much sure of a pile. There you go. You made too you much coming? of a pile. Yeah. You did. All right. See how that nice, lovely windrow? Yeah. This is how the professionals do it. I got caught on your pile every time you stop. <laughs> I won't stop again. Yep. Don't stop. This makes my life more difficult. <laughs> All right. Well. I guess we're doing potatoes. We're doing taters. Oh, this is so weird. Look at you, doing so good. I, I'm, I'm trying, it feels weird. It is weird. Man, actually going fairly quickly though. Right. I mean, we still gotta pick him up. Oh yeah. Wait. You know what? Fun, fun fact, okay. potatoes, 80% water. Okay. Did not know that. Now you do. Yeah. Yeah. The more you know. 
Learn something new every day. All right. Thomas Jefferson introduced French fries to America at a White House dinner. Uh, okay. I bet you can't guess how big the largest potato ever was. No. Seven pounds, one ounce. Okay. That, that's a big tater. Hey, we got we got to pass the time somehow. This is true. You've been on you've been on Google again, haven't you? I have. Hmm. I can tell. I don't, I don't like the TV shows out here. Yeah, they're kind of weird, ain't they? Yeah, they're different. And it, I'm stuck on a hill. Hey, hey, boss man, you, you good? No, I'm stuck on a hill. I gotta back up. You know, it helps if you uh, pick up your heel. It does. It gives you a little bit of ground clearance. All right, all right. Back. We'll fix that later. Oh, hey, you know you're not supposed to be missing parts, right? There, there's like seven million potatoes on this field. It'll be fine. This is true. There is a lot of them. Uh, you know, I'm, I'm happy that it's going this fast, but I'm kind of wondering, isn't this gonna great, like create way more compaction having to drive out here and pick up these rows? Are you asking about the science of farming? Yeah, I should probably shut up now. We, we all know I'm not smart enough to know any of this. No, I don't know any of it either. Well, if you don't know, and I don't know, how are we supposed to teach them, like, what's going on? Like, how to do all this stuff? How are we supposed to teach people? I thought they were going to, you know, teach us. Now, that would be a neat trick. It's potatoes. They're hardy crops. The soil is fine. Just Fair wait enough. till we get the semi on here. That that that's not gonna. Be, you know what? Nope. I'm not. I'm not questioning. Of my pay grade. All I know is I watched a YouTube video and this is how they did it. And if it's on YouTube, it's real. Yeah, hundred percent. It's on the internet. It has to be true. Yeah. Two beautiful green tractors. Although one's kind of lime, but that's okay. Hey, hey. I would much rather have that green than this green. Okay. But red is my favorite color, so I can't say too much. The red harvester. Yeah, yeah. Like we got our American flags over in the UK. Yeah, I wonder how they feel about that. They, they, well, they, they're probably thinking, "Oh, those stupid Americans are at it again." Probably wondering why we chose to harvest potatoes. But they're wondering. Yeah, probably. They got to have their chips, right? It's chips, right? It's chips. Yeah. yeah. That's, the, they, that's the French fries. Yeah. Yeah. We, we got to give them their chips. All right. See, this is this is why we, we got to, we got to, I don't know. Like, you got to go on the outside. I got to go on the inside. I got to let you go next time. Yeah. I mean, it'd be nice, but I'm, I'm okay with waiting. Not bad. All right. It, it, it's all right. It's all right. We're all, we're all trying new things. It's okay. No. The sun's rising. It it, it helps to uh, drop your harvester, there, Clark. Can hey. we grow mustard? We should grow mustard. I don't know. That'd be cool, though. And I have a nice uh, little tangy field. Get some mustard, some potatoes. And we'll... That's not a very good meal. No, no, that does not sound appetizing at all. But we did spend most of our money, so we're going to have to start eating lean pretty soon. Aww. Fair enough. I mean, I did I did call in for some fertilizer and some seeds and some lime. So, yeah, yeah, we're yeah we're definitely out to start eating lean. Oh well, it'll be all right. We'll we'll start making money. Like, I mean, come on. Look at all these potatoes. These Brits gotta have their chips, so we'll be good. We just gotta hope that people are actually catching fish. Well, there are crisps too. We didn't get back into that conversation, so... No, 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 no. Too much, too soon. The largest crisp was 23 inches by Pringles. Wow. Yeah. That's impressive. That's a big potato. That is. That is a very... That is a very big potato. You think it was made from the world's largest potato? I'm not quite sure if Pringles are entirely consisting of potatoes, so I'm going to leave it there. Fair enough. 
I cannot argue that fact. It'll be done in no time. Yeah. This is this is not too bad at all. I mean, I get random facts of the day. And I get to harvest. Yeah. Also, by the way, happy birthday, Dad. Thank you. You're you're you're, you're about as old as the dirt that we're working. I think well, I'm gonna. Hurtful. I think I'm gonna get grounded later. Yes. Oh, great. I at least get to sleep inside this time. Doubtful. Ha! I swing inside and run away. Oh no! And you gotta put a thing down. Hey, hey, you know what? Hey, I'm. I don't judge you. Okay. Look at that. We're almost done. And you finally caught up. Yeah, I finally caught up. Lollygagging. Hey, hey, don't judge me. I, I, I do things in my own time. Okay. And it, it still gets done. It kicked this field into teeth. Yeah, we did. This was gone by really fast. I am kind of surprised. So who's picking up all the potatoes? Well, we were going to talk about that because I had a thing at a place later. I, I think I get I think I get get what's being said here. What you're saying You'll is fine. Oh, crap. That's what I thought you, know what? you were I'll, saying. I'll run the first load with you and show you how to do it. OK, okay. We, we, we can do that. I think we got what? One and a half passes, not counting yours. Yeah, we're about done here. I'll let you finish this up and I'm going to go get the uh, deal. So I just I just need to do this. Yep, do this. Drive over the taters and I drive next to you and try not to crash into you. Okay. Look at us. We're actual potato farmers. I'm so proud of you. I'm trust me, I'm I'm starting to get proud of myself. Okay. Yeah, this isn't gonna be so bad. Wait. Oh. Who's Who's gonna drive? Oh, I need to find I need to make a friend, don't I? You need to make friends, yes. Aww. I'm not going to be around all the time. That I'm getting old. This is true. Crap, this means you're going to make me be social. It, it wouldn't kill you to go out there and, you know, put yourself out, tell some jokes, be, be friendly. Oh, I, I can do all of that. But, I mean, you, 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 what, you just gave a list of three things? Yeah. Okay, the best you're going to get is two out of those three. Hey, if it was good enough for me, Lope, it's good enough for you. Oh, fair enough. I mean, there's a lot of things that was good enough for meatloaf. Now I'm hungry. I want meatloaf. Touche. All right. Can we make it? Can we pick all this up? At oh. Yeah, we got it all. Okay, so where do you want us to uh, put all of these potatoes? So again, I read a uh, I read a, a blog post. Apparently, they store potatoes in a in a shed. Okay, they put them on the ground. Really? That's what it said. That that hmm, that doesn't seem. Well, I mean. It came from in the ground, so I guess. Hey, if it's good enough for under my kitchen cabinet, it's good enough in a shed, right? Yeah, but don't they always grow those little things under the cabinet? Those are just extra extra starch. It's good for you. Oh. Okay. Did not know that. Should have told my mom that. She always threw them out when they did that. It's good for you. You need to get poisoned by potatoes. Really? Yeah. I did not know that. There's something about if they sit out, they develop some sort of chemical, and if you eat them, you could die. Well, dude, that just means you need to eat potatoes fast, kids. All right, we're full. Okay. So I'm going to let you, because you need to practice, take this and dump it in the shed. Okay. We got like nine sheds. Pick one. Okay, I'll go. Okay. All right. Yep. Go do this. Truck with your hat on it. 
Mm, my fancy truck. Well, everybody, um, I guess I'm going to uh, go make friends and, you know, try and figure out where to put these potatoes and then see if any of my newfound friends want to come drive a tractor for me. If not, um, this is, this is going to be a long day. So with that, you all have a wonderful day. And uh, if you guys like today's video, make sure you smash that thumbs up. If you're new around here, consider subscribing. And with that, I will see you all. Oh, dear Lord, this is bumpy. Later.